my name is David Smith and I'm a watercolorist. Um, I enjoy painting both in the studio and outdoors. Like many of you, I'm on the watercolor journey where I'm hungry for learning and experiences and just enjoying the versatility of this amazing fluid medium. There's just beautiful waterfalls and gardens and lakes and bridges and people and it's just so much life and so much to capture. It's so exciting to watch the colors crossing over the paper and the transparency of one glaze of color going over another color. The medium itself is so versatile. There's so many different ways that you can paint in watercolor, which makes it so fun. Get it taped onto a board and get your paints activated, get your water, get your reference materials. I've taken quite a few workshops from David. He's always fun and energetic and gets me all fired up with new ideas. I just enjoy David so much because he is so enthusiastic and yet he is very clear in his instructions. Even more than painting in watercolor is sharing the enjoyment of painting in watercolor. I'm a teacher by profession. So if I take this brush and try and whip it up, is it gonna work right now? What I'm trying to say is you have to react to what's happening on the paper. I learned techniques that I can use to create my own paintings. It seems like we can start with next to nothing and come out with just an incredible painting. You could be around and comfortably just feel like you're not intimidated. He is part of the class. That's his career. He's a teacher. And when you take a class from him, you get handouts, you get notes. He is so enthusiastic and he breaks down everything so easily for you to paint and he walks you through step by step. I'm not saturating the whole paper. I can, and if you want to, you can get a closer look. You guys are afraid to get in the camera. Yeah. Also the best part about David's workshops is his sense of humor. <laughs> it's so much fun to laugh and have fun together. He draws humor from uh, those around him. But now look at these two are identical, these two are identical, so that's not good. All right, oh, now I got three that are identical. <laughs> Basically what I'm saying is don't do what I do. <laughs> I want them to be inspired to paint. I want them to see how fun the medium is, and I want them to be excited to share with their friends. He re deserves all of his accolades because he, he is passionate about watercolor. I actually started uh, my watercolor journey about 30 years ago when I was studying um, Chinese brush painting and it was a great introduction to the watercolor medium because it taught me to be brave. And the subjects I actually paint are pretty broad, um, but they typically have an attractive mood to them, such as uh, mist coming off the lake, or um, a sunrise, or I love trying to capture the light and the shadow um, across subjects like rocks or pumpkins or a statue. I love the variety of subjects yeah. that he offers. His nature paintings are beautiful, like the In the Mist. We've painted lighthouses, and you learn so many different techniques about how to blend your paint, how to create more interest in your paintings. It's so fun. You can throw water on it and create texture. You can spatter paint. And this painting was produced by masking the whites within the um, painting and then pouring yellows and reds across and, paint, and then painting, uh, pouring the blue across. And of course, I just love making it even crazier, so I'm gonna do that. What do you think? David is a great instructor, there's no doubt. It's been a fun experience. He makes it fun. I love painting with David. He is a gifted teacher, and uh, if you want to improve your watercolors, you should paint with him, he's awesome. So I love painting in watercolor, but even more than painting in watercolor, I love sharing my passion um, with other people. So I'd love to teach a workshop in your area. If you're interested, check out my website. All my contact information's on there. Don't be intimidated by that piece of watercolor paper. 